M0FXB. So we've got our RTO SDR using the Air Spy SDR software that's free. Decoding DMR. So I'll have a listen here. I'll just turn it up. Just one sec. Okay, so that's my hotspot at home. Okay, so how have we managed to get that to do it? So if we look here at these three lines, click these three lines, and we've added a couple of, we've added a thing here called simple DMR. So how do we do that? Simple DMR. We've had to add a few files into the SDR software. So let's just close it down a minute. So if S by SDR software, we get it from here. The link will be in the description. There's other videos on how to install this, but it's quite straightforward. So the information I got was from RTO SDR, which is here. And I clicked this section here. All the links will be in the description. And it took me to this Russian, I think it's Russian file, which I decoded by selecting the language here. And I clicked download here. There you go. And you end up with this zip file here. And if you double click it, like so, you get these three files. So how do we then get it to work on our SDR? The next thing you need to do is go to the actual SDR file where you've got your software for your RTL SDR dongle, which is here. I'll open it fully for you. And it's all here. So all you do is just minimize that, and you need to copy and paste the SDR Sharp DML DLL and the DMR full DLL um, into this file here, where you've got basically you, you know you've got your SDR Sharp for booting up. You've got plugins here, and see all these different files, DLL files. Well, you just copy them into there. So literally, just right click copy and paste into this file, into this section here. Once you've done that, then the next thing you want to do is go into magic line here, double click it, and you'll get this section here. You want to right click, copy this one here. So we just right click and we'll just copy and paste, like so, and then copy, copy. Right, we've got that copied. Sorry if I was away from the mic. Minimize that. Now open this one up. Now what you want to do here is uh, right click on your plugins and select open with and select notepad. Okay, I'm not going to change mine, but then you want to copy and paste the line uh, which is here. It says add key DMR value SDR sharp DMR ends here DMR. And up I put it beneath one that was already there, which is this one. And above here, where well, it's a sharp plugin. Then the important thing is you need to go file and then save. Okay. We haven't changed it, but that's what you need to do. And then close it down. Then just double click SDR sharp as normal. Like so. Right. And then obviously make sure you've selected your dongle and click play. Now at the moment it is we've got if we look at the pl plug in here sorry about this just turn it up a bit if we look at the plug in here you go you sl select the three lines here see it says symbol DMR if that's not there you've made a mistake because that should be there we've already selected it and we've enabled it here there's a little tick here there is something here you can move minimum max I haven't touched that because it's working fine if we turn it up. So that is my DMR hotspot at home on Talk Group 91. Um, so, you know, it could be any DMR talk group or it could be a repeater in your range. And I've just got a normal antenna plugged into my RTL SDR dongle, which I'll just, if you're not familiar with them, I'll just put it into Google here. RTL SDR dongle. They're about £40 for the good one. Don't get the copy one. And uh, we we'll just click here. G 
give you an idea of what they look like. No photographs, of course. That's the inside. There you are. This is the one here you want. See the way it's, it looks? That's the one. <coughs> you don't want the copy one. Um, and the, the setup process, I'll, I'll link a video in this. So, yeah, great. Let's get you listening to DMR, and it's only going to cost you about £40. 7-3, all the best.